My name is Joanna Branson, and I'm going to do photojournalism and psychological research on sex trafficking. Sex trafficking can take many forms. My focus is on sexual abuse and forced prostitution. One question I've been asked is why I want to study this. And I think the main reason is in 2008, I went on a photojournalism trip to Ethiopia. While I was there, I met four girls who wanted to get out of prostitution. As a photo team, we use photography as a way to tell their story. And suddenly, complete strangers were donating to help the girls start their own coffee shop and begin new lives. I knew then that photography could make a difference, but I also knew I wanted to be able to bring more than just a camera. I wanted to walk alongside their psychological recovery, so I went to school to study psychology. Now I have developed a research structure to study the effects of recovery treatment. The organizations I'll be working with have creative ways of treating the survivors of these events. They utilize tools like art therapy, sewing, baking, music, dance, and jewelry making as a means to provide answers and job training. My book is going to be about the impact of these creative recovery tools and the stories that go along with them. I want to tell these stories not only with words and statistics, but with my photographs. This photo book will accompany my research and being a collection of all of the stories that I record. I'll start in China, then go to Cambodia, then to Thailand, then to India, from there to Nepal, all the way to Amsterdam, and then finish in Iceland. Another question I get is why do I want to use film photography? And the answer to that is because I love it. I studied it in Germany when I was in YWAM, and I used film during my time in Africa and I truly believe it captures emotion in a way that is different than any other medium.